The separation between church and state is at the center of a debate on our 11 Life Facebook page. It's all over a new law in South Dakota. The law requires all public schools to display the phrase in God we trust, and it can't just be anywhere. The phrase must be displayed in a common area where students are most likely to see it. It must also be at least a square foot in size. School districts are spending the rest of the summer adding those signs. Even working with our buildings and grounds crews to put this motto up across our district. And so they pretty much have it done and it will be up for everyone to see um, by the start of school. Six other states have similar laws. 11 Alive is where Atlanta speaks and hundreds of you are sounding off about this story on our Facebook page. Beverly loves the idea. She says, quote, wonderful. It's about time we put God back into our schools. But Tracy disagrees. She wrote, quote, they need to put this in churches, not the school. And Sheldon says it seems fairly inclusive. Well, a North Carolina political science professor agrees. Jerry says in God we trust is somewhat of a generic term and it doesn't spe specify the God of a specific region, religion rather. That's why the courts have allowed it. Courts have ruled against displaying the Ten Commandments in public places. That's because they're based specifically in Christianity. And here's another civics lesson for you. In God We Trust is actually the official model of motto of the United States, and it has been since 1956.